Oh, Mike Bordick here and today's special guest, Wayne Kirby. And we are some 37 feet high atop the green monster here at Fenway Park. And the reason we're here, of course, Wayne Kirby, Orioles outfield coach for the uh, Orioles. And he actually played here at Fenway Park and is so familiar with all the incredible quirks that this park has to offer. I mean, it's 310 down the left field line, got the 37 foot high green monster that stretches some 200 plus feet towards center field. It's 420 feet in center with all kinds of angles. It's 302 down the right field line and 380 at its deepest part. Wayne, how the heck do you play outfield here at Fenway Park? Well, we start with the hardest one, left field. Um, hardest thing about left field is the, the, high fly, the high fly ball. You don't know if you're gonna catch it or if you're gonna hit off the wall. So your first move is to get back to the wall, hands out to see if you can catch it. And then if you don't catch it, if, you, if it's not catchable, you gotta retreat at least five feet off the wall or to go over your head because it's a big bounce. The higher the wall is on the wall, the bigger the bounce is from off the um, off the one and track. How about how about though? They, we hear all the time that the Fenway single. You know, a guy hits a ball, he crushes it. Looks like it's going to go about 360. Hits off the wall. Next thing you know, he's putting the brakes on. Well, uh, this team is familiar with it because uh, they play here all the time. If we look at the, if you go on the, on the ground level, if you look at this uh, monster, it angles out. So every ball's hit going to carry them to your right. So they play it perfect, and then it's just a, a one-hop throw or all the way in, and you're done. It's just an automatic single unless you misplay it. So that's the way you got to take it. So when you played left field here, you played center field mm -hmm. here. Um, you talked about left field being so tricky, obviously. With well, the garage is also the bad <laughs> thing, too. <laughs> yeah. well, once the ball go in the garage down there on, right, <laughs> yeah. on left field line, it stays in the garage. So you got to go in the garage, back out, and throw the ball out. So. Right. Another tricky area. Absolutely. There's only like two or three feet of foul ground down there, but it gets hung up, doesn't it? Hung up fast. <laughs> yes, it does. A center field, 420 out there. It's a 17 high wall, foot high wall. So, I mean, that makes it even uh, the degree of difficulty even that much more difficult. Well, out in center is, is probably a little more easier. The only thing we have to worry about is that wall like Adam Jones hit on last night. I hit on that wall, it don't give, and I don't care how much padding it has, but you have a lot of room. And it also depends on the scouting report on this team. You know, right now this team is a pull hitting team. So we, we're playing on this side and giving them that with Joey Rickard with his speed. So we can handle that pretty good. And even if the ball carry him off left center field, it's going to carry him to Jonesy. And, and hopefully he can make a quick, quick, quick throw in. So. Well, as a center fielder as here, center though, field. I mean, you have really got to cover some ground, exactly. right? Exactly. I mean, it's, we haven't even talked about <laughs> what I think is the hardest field, the right field here, 380, 302 down the line, and, man, does it jet out. I mean, it can get hooked up in that corner. Seems like the center fielder's got to just be backing, backing up, up all, all the time. time. <laughs> well, I mean, right field, again, is tricky. Any ball hit down the line, you got to play it safe. you got to play it safe. you got to play it almost right, right at Jordan's Furniture. Just catch the ball, throw it in, and take your time to do it. Or it'll jet all the way around past the bullpen. So you can't attack that ball. You got to see what the ball's going to do, and eventually play it off the wall the right way. That little short pincy pole. You try to get there as much as you can. You yeah. try to get there as much as you can, fast as you can. Depends on the angle. Depends on the number of strikes. You go from there. Well, some great insight there from Wayne Kirby. Uh, he's covered just about every outfield position here, uh, helping the Oriole outfielders play a more solid defense here at Fenway Park. And thanks a lot, Wayne, for being a part of the show today. Thank you. Expertise. <laughs>